Chinese flower and bird painting. Unfold scroll of Chinese flower and bird painting, with magpies chirping and plums blooming in the snow. Wild singing birds and fragrant flowers appear on the painting. The fun and emotions are hidden in it. Flower and bird painting is one of the three traditional Chinese painting families. Flowers, birds, animals, fish, and insects are common themes. From the third century to the sixth century, flower and bird painting became an independent family. Then it flourished, and many masters emerged one after another. Bianluan, in the middle and late Tang Dynasty, was good at painting flowers and birds. His works were extremely exquisite, which made him known as the father of flower and bird painting. There are three methods of flower and bird painting. Fine brushwork is meticulous with bright colors, while freehand brushwork is concise with elegant artistic conception. And the third method is the combination of fine brushwork and freehand brushwork. Huang Quan's painting work, rare birds, vividly depicts. Twenty-four kinds of animals in fine strokes, including birds, turtles, and insects. In Xu Xi's painting work, bamboos in the snow, the tall and straight bamboos show the aesthetic concept of the painter. The contrast of these two painting works reflects the different styles of flower and bird painting. The flowers, birds. Fish and insects in the painter's works repose on the aesthetic relationship between human and other creatures. The plums in the snow, the elegance of orchid, the straightness of bamboo, and the tenacity of chrysanthemum are all Chinese literati's love for nature and life.